Hey folks, remember I showed you this nice little tool, this nice little tool right here. It was called the Daiwa Saku tool. And what it was made for is making a nice little knot. If you look at the very end, you push this button and there's a little micro hook right in there and I showed you how this little tool it's a little Japanese gadget makes a really nice little knot real quick real fast in the wind in the bouncing boat it doesn't matter let me go ahead and make one for you right here real quick okay Take some braid. This is for a braid to mono connection. All right. So what we got here is we got 20 pound braid, 20 pound mono. You lay the two together. You're going to take it. You got to just have a length of mono not attached to anything. Just laying, laying by itself. What you do is you come in here and you make a loop. Okay. So then over here is your leader, your mono leader. You take the tool. You stick the tool in there. Then your loop. You go one, two, three. You push out the little hook. You grab the line that you've been holding over here, you let it go, and you pull it on through. Alright, pull your motto on through, and there's the beginning of the knot. Now, of course, you wet it, and pull all of it tight. And actually, you like to pull each tag end Okay, and I do it with my teeth, unfortunately. And there you go. You got a super quick little tiny knot that is super duper strong. Okay, for connecting braid to mono light mono light braid to light mono you go in and you cut the ends all right i showed you this before but what i'm going to do is i'm going to these scissors ain't all that great and there's a little tiny knot that'll pass through your guides no problem. Okay. So. But let's say you don't have the little gadget. The little Daiwa Soku knot tying tool. Let's say you don't have that. Well, let's say you don't want to buy this little tool. Because it's nothing but a little Japanese gadget. But you happen to have, and much cheaper, a little pair of stainless steel hemostats laying around. Or you can get these a lot less than 20 bucks. You can buy them like bulk on eBay. Alright. So let's take a piece of our mono. 20 pound mono. That we're going to use as our leader. And use as our leader because we're doing the braid to mono connection. You're going to lay them against each other again, form a loop, All right? Make that loop the same. Take this.
this, I hold it in these fingers over here, and you're going to take your hemostats now, go in both of the loops, go one, two, three, come around, and grab both over here, and pull both through. Alright. So, pull your mono on the way through. And this is identically the same knot you just did with the Soku tool. Okay. We're going to wet it. And then we're going to pull each tag end tight. And there you go. You got, I mean, that baby is super strong. So then, same thing. You go in and you cut off your ends. your tags here you can do that relatively close that one isn't all that close right there with the braid but that's a little tiny knot now that has super strength that will go flying in and out of your guides and you won't even notice it's there all right so one or the other. Of course, I love the gadget. I love gadgets. If you don't have a gadget, and you got something like this laying around, then you can master the same knot by just using this. You can also do this by hand with no tools. This just makes, this makes it falling off the stump easy. Okay. And this makes it easier. So let's say, I've got this up in my boat. I keep this in my boat all the time, and I use it probably three, four times a day. Then what happens? I'm sitting at home. I don't feel like going out in the boat just to get this. I grab my little hemostats here, and we could do it with these. Now I've got, I think I've got several pairs of these that a friend gave me who's in the medical field there's these straight ones and here's ones with a little bit of a curve on them okay it doesn't really matter all you're going in is using them to loop go in and grab it and pull it through so there you go folks there's a little tip making the same knot that this makes which is really a great knot Okay, this is the Daiwa Soku tool, S-O-K-K-O-U, and it can't be found or anything in any tackle shops. It should be. I don't know why these things like this don't show up at American tackle shops, but they should. Alrighty, so thanks for watching.